We're getting all kinds of first today. First time we've killed Deathclaws. First time we've killed Mirelord Kings. And the first time I hurt my pants in the process of doing it. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a death claw, and we're still in danger. Oh, shit. Ooh, scary. Several episodes ago, we're still in danger. I was asking the question, well, I was making a comment that I didn't remember if there were death claws in Fallout 3. Uh, they're definitely in New Vegas. And uh, we just had that question answered for us. Death claw meat and a death claw hand. Look at those hands. Oh shit, we're in danger! Woo! -hoo. Where are you? Oh my god. Are we bleeding? Oh yeah, we're bleeding. Uh actually I think something else is attacking us. Combat Ultra Stim. Hydra. Uh Solve it all. So I think something's attacking me from behind. Um, oh, yeah, it's a fucking robot. Ah! Jesus. Everything wants to eat me. Okay, I think we have a couple scorpions that were after us. By the way, just for the record, on that... S oh, good. Finally, the rain stopped. Uh... That second Yao Guai that attacked us, I didn't mean to hit the that's button. Sometimes I just panic and shit happens. <laughs> so there you go. Whew. I just about filled my pants on that one. Okay, so are there more? Well, we know there's at least one more death claw around there. We never I never discovered... Wait, what the hell? Oh, never mind. Uh, we never discovered what this place was either. Okay. Uh, let's see. We looted... Death Claw Hand. That's got a VW of 25. Oh, it only weighs a pound. Okay. 
And then we looted Deathclaw Meat, which only has a VW of four. I'm curious, though, as to what kind of recipe we can make with it when we cook it. We need to eat, too, by the way. But even more importantly than that, we need to drink. So let's take an MRE and a purified water, a Nuka. And what is this going to do to us? It's funny that <clears throat> that whiskey quenches your thirst in this game because it sure doesn't in real life. Okay. Let's go back down. We'll loot the meat and claws off these other guys too. And it, it looks like we... You know, some of our buffs wore off, so we need to heal back up. Okay. Deathclaw egg. Uh, all right. That's not considered food. It's got a VW of 5.7, and it's 7 pounds. All right, we'll hang on to it until we start getting encumbered, and then we might have to get rid of it. All right, we know there's at least one more Deathclaw around here. We saw him around the other side of the building. Let's see if we can take his ass out before he takes our ass out. Oh, yeah, there he is right there. Why do I hear water? That's weird. Oh, I guess there is a little bit of water there. You know, it would be safer if we took him out up here. Just give us a little more time to react. Let's wait for our head to clear. We just need a good headshot. Scary motherfuckers. Got him. Okay. While we're up here, can't see anything when this happens. I have not, I think I've already told you guys this, but I have not been able to find a doctor's bag recently from any of the vendors. So they're in short supply. Okay, um, let's move out. I still, <coughs> still not healed. Take an antiseptic, take a bandage. Take a blood pack. Okay, now it's going up. there. Now I wished I would have brought my machine gun with me.
I mean, the shoddy does all right, Pice. There's no doubt about that, but... Uh, okay, we got a caution. Well, we certainly softened him up. But we did not kill him. Old Olney. Okay, so we got something on the map now. Did we... Did we kill him? Maybe he bled out. Because I am not seeing any movement. Just hightailed it out of here. Oh. Alright, we're still in danger. Oh, no, don't do that. Don't. God damn it. I'm trying to reload and it thinks I want to loot the thing. Woo! How many of these things are there? We get a super Stimpak debuff. I don't even know what that does. Don't think I want to know what that does. <clears throat> Let's do a solve at all. Are we hurt anywhere else beside the head? No. Okay. Just... We're just messed up in the head, but what else is new? All right, let's take... Well, we can't take a med kit while we're in combat. I don't want to... All right, we'll take another combat stim. I thought I heard a turret. It's a robot right over that way. Here are a couple of deceased individuals. Oh man. Can't one of you guys have a frickin' doctor's bag on you? Looks like this is as far this direction we can go.
bunch of death and destruction right there. Another super stim pack. We just got a blood pack, so let's take that to get our health back up. Did we hit everything over here? I think so. Like that might be a door we can actually go inside. Okay, we got a caution. I hear footsteps over that way. I feel like I spend half my life with a concussion in this game. Okay, let's go down this street. You know, something we haven't actually used yet is one of these. I think not sure but i think if we attack something then it breaks the stealth Sewer entrance to Olney sewers. Hmm. Oh. See, I'm not so sure I wanna go crawling around in sewers with death claws. We're getting sorta of starting to get low on ammo. I mean we could come back and do it with our machine gun and just a shite ton of 308s. Okay, there we go. He probably can't get, uh, well, he might be able to get to us from up here. That didn't break our stealth. Oh, okay, it just wore off. But the attack didn't break it, is my point.
Okay, let's go back to town. Yeah, we fired off a lot of slugs in this episode. So, I don't really feel like we have enough to go traipsing around in a sewer with death claws. Pretty sure there's something over in that area because I heard footsteps. Yep, yeah, right there. Can that, that thing get to us, though? Uh, that didn't work. Let's go in here. Shit. Okay. Uh, this is this is a big place, my God. I, yeah, I just, I don't think we're properly equipped to be doing interiors around here. We will tentatively plan on coming back, uh, especially since it's, this seems like a place that a quest will probably eventually lead us to anyway. And uh, when we do... Didn't the interior of that place look way bigger than the exterior? You know, we'll be uh, much better equipped to handle this and hopefully not have a head concussion. Alright, let's just go down this street. Is that a trap? I think it is. Thank goodness we didn't fall into it. something over here? No, I guess not. All right. Well, I think we're finished here for now. It was quite an adventure. And what do we kill? About maybe a half dozen death claws? Say those are pretty decent bragging rights. So I want to go to the extreme north east end of the map just to say that we did. Is there anything up there? What in the actual f fuck? That's that's one of those creature from the Black Lagoon thingies that we saw in the Anchorage Memorial. Is he like a Mirelurk king or something?
I'd like to loot him and see what he is. We're going to take some radiation here. Oh, yeah, he's a Mirelurk King. Wow. Okay. We're getting all kinds of first today. First time we've killed Deathclaws. First time we've killed Mirelurk Kings. The first time I shit my pants in the process of doing it. There's stuff down there. I think that fence is probably going to be our limit. No, nope, maybe not. We've got a little, a little more distance we can go. Oh, and we crashed. Oh, gosh. Um. Hmm. Well, we know the game saved when we left that building, at least, and I don't think I saved after that. I'm kind of curious if there's anything up here. Ramp camp. wonder if this is one of our bounty locations. Wasteland. Tequila. There's nothing in the safe. That's disappointing. Yeah, he's pretty scary. Pretty damn scary. Hey. Hey. What do you need? I need a doctor's bag. If the price is right. I'll take the immuno boosters. Um, okay, so she has 178 caps. Let's buy these 556s, the bandage, the combat stim. The Hydra. Okay, and then we will sell her the metal armor and the auto revolver, the silence pistol, the nine millimeter submachine gun, the AKA 112. Oh, that put us over. Here, let's accept that. Okay, so she has 78 caps left. Uh, we'll sell her the defense machine gun. I don't have my selling clothing on, but whatever. Oh, do you have any water? No, she doesn't. Pre-war money. Cigar. Oh, no, that puts you over. Okay. 22 more caps. What can we sell her for 22 caps? How about... Yeah, we'll give her, we'll give her a two cap bonus there. How's that? A pleasure doing business with you. Whatever. Yeah, <laughs> you too. Whatever. All right, good. So that lightened us up. Got us a few caps. Uh, we're now at 308 on our weight. Okay. Let's get to that northeast corner. Oh, 
Oh, we crashed again. I wonder if there's something funky going on in the northeast corner of this game. Let's try it one more time. There's something up there. Let's go discover that. Wagner's Cavern. Requires a key. We don't have it, do we? Nope. Okay. Wagner's Cavern. Ca Wagner's Cavern. Bibba. Okay, we are basically at the end of the road. And we're probably going to get the message. Don't go over there because there be monsters and game crashes. Okay. That looks like a... Brotherhood or an enclave? I believe that's the enclave. Well, is it? I don't know. Yeah, I think it is. Okay. I don't think these guys are hostile. Let's do a normal save here. I don't want to overwrite my quick save in case we are indeed in unstable territory. And let's just see what happens when we walk over here. Oh, I don't know. When I put my crosshair on him, it turns red. That usually means they're not very friendly. That individual appears to be in some kind of hazmat suit, I think. Hmm. Well, I'm afraid if we go traipsing in there, we're going to get our ass handed to us. You know, the thing is, though, is you'd think he would see us by now. And I'm not... Okay, there... Oh, okay. There's a caution. Alright, well, that confirms that they are indeed enemies, then. Which means we need to snipe them, because that's what you do when you run into enemies, is you snipe them. They did. Alright. That wasn't pretty, but we got the job done. Now, we still have that other one that's traipsing around in a hazmat suit. But I do not see that individual from here. Uh, what the hell is that? I have no idea. I think that's a turret. Because I'm getting a red crosshair for it. That's exactly what that thing was. Now the question is, are there more of them? Okay. Uh, let's go down there.
open cage door. Enclave foot locker. 80 bottle caps. Nice. That's a nice little chunk of bottle caps. Cigarette. 80 bottle caps. Enclave officer. Laser pistol's in good shape. We'll take that. I think we'll take the uniform just because it's uh, unique. I don't know if we're going to have a room here to get these guys' power armor. Okay, that's Mark II armor, and that's Tesla armor. Uh, okay. Yep, we're too heavy. Plasma rifle with uh, some mods. And your on uh, recon helmet is in better shape than this guy's, but this guy's armor is in better shape than yours. All right, now, can we... Well, let's just look at this for a minute. <clears throat> it's too bad we didn't run across that um, vendor again. We could have gotten rid of some of this shit. Okay, so the recon helmet looks pretty much like the Brotherhood recon helmet, and it's not worth shit, so let's get rid of that. The Power Armor Mark II has 34 damage resistance and 17 damage threshold. The Tesla Armor is energy resistant has two less damage resistance. Both of these weigh 45 pounds. Damn. Energy resistance, charisma. Okay. I take that back about taking the officer's uniform. It's not worth much. Well, I don't know. One play of officer hat. They're all about energy weapons, aren't they? Yeah, let's get let's get rid of the recon armor. I want to take the mods off of these guys. Okay. Yeah, we're going to have to have a come to Jesus meeting here with our stuff. Either that or I'm going to ha have to make a trip, but this is a long way to go to make a trip. And I'd still like to know where that hazmat suit person went. Watch them pop out of nowhere and just blast us. Let's check this crate and over there. And we're going to have to then stash some things. Another first for this episode. We found a new faction, the Enclave faction. Fall back to regroup. Uh, scope's clean. There's no one here. Retreating. Target trace lost. Okay. Well, that explains where they went. These are like their little, their little bunk thingies. 
I can't open the, the door. There she is right there. Will she, will she come out of her own accord? It's like she's trying to. Fall back. Target tray's lost. She's an enclave scientist. Fall back. Retreating. One thing I could do is I could try and take some ant nectar. That gives us four strength. That would probably be enough to carry all this shit, but we'd have to move because it doesn't last really long. Target has escaped. Retreating! So she apparently doesn't know how to open her own uh Zoom standard patrol procedures. Retreating. Got nothing here. What the fuck? Retreating. Standing down. Why from alert. did that Retreating. Why did that go off? Standing down from alert. Oh, I'll bet she set Retreating. it off. Yep, that's what happened. Cancel okay. Alert. Fall back to regroup. Well, got nothing here. I'm going to Fall back. Alert. I'm gonna leave that there in case she decides Retreating. she can come out. Let's just go check over Fall here, back. and then we're then we'll see if we can pop an ant nectar and GTFO. Ultra stim, psycho hydra fixer, and lots of caps. Nice. Is our light on or off? Now it's on. Okay. Let's do a save. Now I'm going to take an ant nectar. Okay, so we're still, even with that, 40 more pounds overweight. Yeah, okay. So we're gonna have to ditch some stuff. Uh, I mean, I, ditch meaning I can I can come back for it later. So I think what we'll do is we'll just put some things in here. Okay, that's two forty one. I'd like to have this armor just just more for collecting collection reasons. And if we ever needed to disguise ourselves, you know, as the enclave, we would have that too. Um okay, so that that probably is all we need to do, come to think of it. Can we take the mark two with us? And we could leave the We'll leave the Tesla armor here. And let's see, how many more ant nectars do I have? Uh, aid. I got three more. Okay. So what we're going to try and do is get to... No. Get to... I guess Temple of the Union is going to be the closest place... Uh, that has a mole hole. And then we'll, you know, that way we can just have the fast travel system take us from there. But we've, we've pretty much, yeah, we've pretty much gotten all the way to the, oh, there's a bloat fly. Uh, to the northeast corner of the map. We didn't see the message that said, you can't go any further, but that's okay. Close enough. And we found something in the process. Curious if this place is just a place we can discover.
that doesn't look like a raider. Oh, there's a mole hole here. The Republic of Dave. <laughs> of Dave. It's kind of late to be entering the Republic. Hi, Mary. I'm not here to hurt, any hurt anyone. What is this place? This is the Republic of Dave. Duh. <laughs> it's named for President Daddy. But you have to talk to him if you want to stay here. Okay. Um, Do you guys have a doctor that could maybe fix me up? I think I'd like to meet Dave. With, who's this Dave guy? What does he have his own Republic? Um, No, I'd like to meet Dave. Okay. I'll take you. But President Daddy doesn't always like new people. Right. He'll like me. President Daddy says that people from outside the Republic are bad. He's right about that about 90% of the time. I'd like to know more about the public. Um, okay. As long as President Daddy says it's all right. Okay. Tell me more about this, Dave, guys. So what have you been up to, kid? What's your take on the Republic? Uh, tell me more about Dave. He's my daddy. Whenever we play Republic... I get to play as Dave. I see. Watch, watch. I am sorry, sir, but I am afraid that the Bureau of Dave-like activities has ordered your execution. Okay. Aren't I good? You're huh? good. Yep, you're good. Okay, what have you been up to? I'm going to be president when I grow up. Okay, uh, what's your take on the Republic? President Daddy is awesome. He buys all sorts of neat toys that we get to play with. Oh, will he buy stuff from me? Okay. Sure. Um, talk to you later. I have to go practice my Dave impression anyway. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so let's let's discover this molehill. Good. Now, I think we go home, get fixed up, and then we can come back here and talk to Dave. That's what I'm thinking we should do here. Oh. We can Okay, so we can't get all the way back to uh Megaton from here. What's the closest place then? Probably the scrapyard. Well, no, we can go to the regulator headquarters and then from there go to Megaton. Let's just do that. And while we're there, we'll re we'll reset our bounty too, because that other one seemed to be bugged. We do have to remember too that our ant nectar's on the clock, and I'm assuming we can uh we can get addicted to it too. So we gotta be careful. Good to see you again, partner. Uh, hey, actually, where are you, partner? The regulators welcome you back. I got a few fingers for you. The unright. Yep, sure. Unrighteous. So many gotcha. Good deeds should. Yep. Okay, thanks. And two. Okay, 210 Dude. ball caps. Nice. All right, let's go here. Uh, cancel contract. Are you sure you want to cancel contract to bring a fusion of justice? Well, your fucking thing's not working. So, yeah, I guess we just lost half of our caps that we just got for fingers. That's not my fault. Damn it, Jim. Um, okay. Oh, we lost rep, but whatever. Fuck it. Okay. There we go. Okay, so we got a new contract. Let's jump in the mole hole and get to Megaton before this ant nectar wears off. Oh, shoot, I was hoping there'd be a traveling vendor here. Thirsty, partner. All right. Try Moriarty's. Uh, you know what? In the capital wasteland. I seriously doubt Moira's got enough cash for us to sell everything, so we'll go sell at our our caravan vendor in the house, and then I then I'll run up and see the doctor. But um. I think what I'm going to do too, guys, I'm going to wrap up the episode here because I'm like been recording for over two hours. 
as it is. Um, so the plan for the next episode will be to go back to Republic of Dave just so we can kind of figure out what the hell that's all about. <laughs> and then uh, our next, our new bounty is really all the way back to the wrecked shack again. Okay. Everglow National Campground. Wait a minute. No, makeshift shack. That Okay, so this will be new. And, you know, that'll give us an incentive to maybe go way out west and maybe check out Girder Shade too. So that'll be the tentative plan for the next episode. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video. And we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.